Afternoon, David Eco tuning. Um, just going to go through some uh, programming or some retrofitment um, of on this particular model is a BMW with uh, LCI rear lights being fitted. Um, now, in the hot functions, in the retrofitting side of things, it's not actually listed in there. Um, so I'm going to show you how to do it manually. Um, I'm not going to carry out the full procedure because it takes ages. Uh, but I'm just going to show you where you find it. Um, so we're going to go into programming. Click on no on that. It's going to scan the vehicle. It's going to detect what options are fitted to it, what things are fitted to it. Um, this is where you have all the details on the vehicle. The chassis numbers, the assembly numbers, the SA coding. Um, we've already done a video on the SA coding. Uh, it's on our YouTube channel, Mobile Eco Tuning. Um, um, and then you got the E Watt and the HO Watt. Um, so HO Watt being obviously retrofitment. Um, so as you can see on this, it has retrofitment of LCI lights on there, which is MUH1. Um, so I'm just going to take you through that. Um, so if we click on any of these, uh, we're faced with options, and this is where we can change the options of the vehicle. So we're going to click on HO Watt. We're going to click on edit. Okay. So. That's VOSA coding. Let's click on that again. Okay. Let's go all the way to the bottom. Right, so as you can see there, We've got all the SA codes. So we can see what it's fitted with, multifunction steering wheel, like blah, 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 blah. It goes all the way through it. And then at the bottom, you've got your retrofitments there. Um, so if we click on retrofitment of LCI rear lights, this is what we've just done to this vehicle. Um, so obviously we can fit as many as we want, uh, or we can remove what we want. So we're gonna hit edit on there. So you can see that it's in there. You can delete that out if you want, which actually we will do on this vehicle. Click selection. It's going to give you selection of retrofitments applicable to this vehicle. So selection. So let's untick that and we'll take that out. So all of these are your retrofitments. As you can see, there is a lot. It's not just for this vehicle, but there is a few things for other vehicles as well. Um, but as you can see, the list is absolutely massive. Um, so this is where you're clicking on an option and you're going to code it to the vehicle. So once we've clicked the, the one that we want, we're going to click OK. It's going to display in HO what, what options you want fit into it. You're going to press OK again. In this instance, we're reverting it, so we're not putting anything in there. So, as you can see, in the bottom, it would have in there what you're retrofitting to it or what you're removing. We're going to press OK again. Um, and as you can see now, it's going to say what it's going to be doing. So, it's deleting MUH1, which is retrofitment of rear LED lights. I'm going to press Yes. Successful. So, now that's done. That's removed it out of the HO wall. You can see it's not in there anymore. We're going to continue. We're going to press OK. This part now takes a good few minutes. Um, and it's going to take you into the coding and programming menu. Once we've got into the coding and programming menu, you're going to go into coding and you're going to code the vehicle. Um, don't bother with programming. Don't bother with replacement. Just encoding. Let the vehicle encode. Once it's finished, you'll see that it is all updated correctly. If you need anything else, watch our YouTube videos, give us a bell, have a look on our website. Cheers!